You will need each other. Our Lady to Gisela Cardia on December 19, 2020. Dear children, thank you for having responded to my call in your hearts. My children, the world is godless, everything is godless. Men, politicians and the mass media have passively accepted what the devil has suggested in order to complete the work of destruction, but you, beloved children, are not alone, remember that we are with you. Children, this singular Christmas, be calm and joyful at the coming of the Savior who, as then, will come in humility. Do not be afraid, approach it in prayer, whoever is in Christ has the certitude that they will not be touched. 1. Be united, children, you will need each other, famine will soon arrive, Two. And you will need to be ready to help one another as brothers and sisters. I love you and console you when you invoke me. Italy will be shaken very strongly, pray. Now I leave you with my motherly blessing in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Footnotes. 1. Should be understood in spiritual terms, not necessarily material, physical ones. 2. The United Nations World Food Program, WFP, warned that, as a result of the coronavirus, the number of people facing food crises around the world could double to 265 million people by the end of this year. In a worst-case scenario, we could be looking at famine in about three dozen countries, and in fact, in ten of these countries we already have more than one million people per country who are on the verge of starvation, David Beasley, Director WFP, April 22, 2020, CBSNews.com. Already in America, four of every ten people seeking food aid are now doing so for the first time. The disruption of the food supply chain through lockdowns is catastrophic leading the World Food Programme Special Envoy to declare, we may well have a doubling of world poverty by early next year. We may well have at least a doubling of child malnutrition because children are not getting meals at school and their parents and poor families are not able to afford it. This is a terrible, ghastly global catastrophe, actually. Lockdowns just have one consequence that you must never, ever belittle, and that is making poor people an awful lot poorer, Dr. David Nabarro, World Health Organization, WHO, Special Envoy, October 10, 2020, The Week in 60 Minutes No. 6 with Andrew Neal, Gloria.tv.